And at number four, we're still in Ann Arbor where there's controversy because there's strict new rules that would require you to shovel your sidewalk every time it snows, no matter how much snow falls. Simon Shaykhead is in Ann Arbor asking tough questions and getting answers. Here's a question. Just how clean are the sidewalks in Ann Arbor? Well, some say not nearly clean enough, and now it's time to pay up. How often do you shovel your sidewalk? As often as it snows. Are most of the sidewalks in good shape? Uh, this part of time, not so much. Students tend to not shovel so consistently. Call it a cold-hearted crime, not shoveling the sidewalk in front of your home when it's snow-covered and icy. It's more than inconsiderate. It's downright dangerous. Everyone's got to use them. People have a right to be able to get around town on foot without slipping. But did the city of Ann Arbor slip up by not getting tougher on its worst offenders? The mayor has recently asked a group of concerned citizens to suggest solutions. We reached one of them by phone. The whole purpose is to make it safer for pedestrians. We had a lot of circumstances last year of wheelchair users in the roads because they couldn't use the sidewalks. Now, here comes the controversy. Currently, the city says you have to clean up your walk if there's an inch or more of snow and you have 24 hours each time it snows. A new ordinance being considered would force people to shovel every time it snows, no matter how much or how little. And eventually, there could be strict fines imposed by ordinance officers for those who ignore the rules. On the streets tonight, we find mixed reviews. It's complicated. It's your own sidewalk, but everyone else uses it. It's not just for you. So it's a question of being your own personal space versus a public space. What about those that can't afford to pay the fines? Again, I, I don't necessarily know the best way to enforce it, but I, I definitely do think that it would be reasonable to have some kind of um, regulation. In just a couple weeks here at Ann Arbor City Hall, they will be voting on the new proposed ordinance. In the meantime, tell us what you think on Facebook and Twitter and WXYZ.com. From Ann Arbor, Simon Shaykhet, 7 Action News.